Welcome to another edition of Around the Court. I'm Sydney Finkel with Mustang News, and today I am joined by junior Job Alexander. Job, how are you doing today? I'm good, and you? Good. So, you ready to do this? Yeah. Okay, let's go. So, to start off, um, you guys are taking on Hawaii this weekend, who you actually just played last weekend. Mm -hmm. So, what kind of adjustments are you going to make to hopefully get a different result? Um, we just saw a few things they did offensively and defensively. We saw it on film, and um, it's going to be better this time. So you have made your way into the starting lineup recently, starting the last four games. What kind of personal improvements did you make in order to earn that position? Uh, just being smarter with the basketball, uh, staying aggressive, um, taking my shots when they come, and just playing, uh, bringing it defensively. Okay, so born and raised in Wisconsin, and then played junior college in Colorado, and now at Division One Cal Poly in California. What kind of um, adjustments have you had to go through with that, and what's the difference in playing style? Um, I say... From back home, it's a lot quicker, mm -hmm. like quicker uh, speed of the game. Um, off the court, the weather has been much better, except for recently. <laughs> okay, so I do have to ask, why do you wear number one? Um, I don't know. I always wore it since I was little, and so I made sure I got it in high school, Juco, and now here. Awesome. Did it mean something special to you? No, nah, just, <laughs> just number it's one. always been my number. <laughs> okay, so do you have any hidden talents or hobbies that not many people know about? Um, well, I mentioned it before, but uh, a lot of people don't know I'm a musician. Um, I used to play the piano. I can rap, and I'm about to get into production, too. Oh, wow. So off the court, what would you say that you and your teammates do to bond and get to know each other better? Um, like we'll get together like for sports, uh, sport events, certain games. Uh, we play Fortnite together. I say that brings us together the most. Who is the best on the team at Fortnite? Uh, me. <laughs> Who would you think is the worst right, on the team? Um, the worst? <laughs> um, I have to say Junior Ballard. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Okay, so almost everyone I've talked to on this team says that this is either the closest or one of the closest teams they've ever played on. Do you kind of see that transitioning into the play on the court? Uh, yeah, I feel, um, you know, since the summer we started getting together, we started clicking uh, on and off the court, and um, we trust each other out on the court, and, you know, we, we all know we're playing for each other. Okay, so is there a professional player or a professional team that you try to model your game after? Um, no, I mean, I, you know, I try. I like James Harden, but, you know, I'm me. I like that. So who is your favorite player on the men's basketball team? On our team? Yep. Um, you can say I yourself. I say, <laughs> no, I'm not going to be that selfish. I say Don Fields. Okay, why is that? Man, I just seen him make amazing plays. He brings it every day. And, you know, when he's going, it's over. Okay, so as we come to the end here, one more question. Taking on Hawaii, unfortunately lost last weekend. Taking on UC Irvine right before that. So how are you? how is your mindset going into this weekend? You know you have tough, tough competition coming up. Um, I mean, it's kind of stuff we look for. Number one seed, Irvine, take it to their place, um, pull off an upset, and then protect the home court on Saturday. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Job. This has been another edition of Around the Court. I'm Sydney Finkel with Mustang News. Thanks for watching. Thank you.